everyone, Jim with Evolution Power Sports. Today we want to talk about flex fuel tuning for the Can-Am X3, Maverick R, HD11. Um, what, what is flex fuel? Okay. Flex fuel is uh, a program that we've designed uh, for these vehicles uh, that utilizes a flex fuel sensor uh, and our proprietary programming uh, that allows you to run ethanol-based fuels out of the pump. Okay. Um, you can run Anything from you know E0, which would be pure 91 octane, non-oxygenated, uh, all the way up to about E95. Okay, um, and the reasons there's there's four main reasons why someone would want to run you know E85 or ethanol-based fuels. Uh, first is power. Okay, we can get more power uh, out of E85 or you know E90 you know, these higher ethanol contents than virtually any other fuel out there, okay? Uh, E85 is rated at between 105 and 110 research octane. So that's a, that's a lot more than, you know, your, your typical 91 octane pump gas. The second reason is convenience, okay? In, historically, when customers want to run E85, uh, they have to buy it out of the barrel because, or, or take your tester to different you know, fuel stations and actually test the fuel to make sure it's within that, you know, narrow window uh, between like E80 and E85. Okay, and the reason is, is that um, the stock ECU programming uh, without an ethanol sensor uh, can't compensate for the different um, uh, mixtures of ethanol that comes out of the pump. Okay. When you buy E85 out of the pump, it can be anywhere from E50 to E90. That's, that's the government spec for E85. Okay. Um, and that just won't work in uh, cars that aren't, or vehicles that aren't designed for it. Uh, the third reason is um, safety. Okay. Uh, Ethanol-based fuels are safer. Um, we can make more power safer than virtually any other um, gasoline based uh, fuels okay there's a lot of reasons for that which I'm not going to get into here but mainly it's octane and the cooling effect of the um, of the charge air as the ethanol is evaporated going into the engine okay and the fourth reason is cost okay when you buy E85 out of the barrel it can be very expensive it's almost as expensive as buying race fuel it's between five and seven dollars a gallon Whereas if you pull up to your local uh, station that carries E85, it's generally about 250 a gallon. So it's the it's the best cheapest race fuel you can get. Okay, and you know, and the other thing too is that you know a, a lot of customers have you know anxiety about being able to get E85 wherever they go. Right, if they're out of Glamis and they bring a 55 gallon drum, and now all of a sudden they've gone through all their fuel, what are they going to do? Okay, so. Our programming automatically compensates for the ethanol content. So when you, um, if you run out of E85, just fill it up with 91, you're good to go. Programming adjusts down so that it's safe on 91 or adjusts up all the way to, you know, about E95. So it's a great uh, feature uh, for, you know, the, the owners of vehicles that we just specified. We will be incorporating flex fuel into uh, other vehicles in the future. And as you can see here uh, on this 25X3, it's so simple, okay? Uh, plugs right into the diagnostic port. Our little module sits right on top of the, the gas tank, okay? And the flex fuel sensor mounts in the tunnel. So very simple, very easy, no need to change programs. Uh, you just load the one program in and then you're good to go. So if you want to get out there and win more races and not have to jicky jack around and save money and have a lot of safety built into your tune, get the Evolution Power Sports Flex Fuel Tuning for the Can-Am X3, the Maverick R, and coming soon for the HD11. Check out our website evopowersports.com.